All right, guys, so we're gonna try this sucker out. See what we can do. Um, well, <laughs> man, that thing works. Works nice. Wow, that is. That works nice. <laughs> that, that works pretty good. I like that. Catch myself in the head. Yeah, that 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 works nice. Yeah, man. So there you go. I should show you. I'll go over here and chop on this uh, log a little bit see how she does chopping um, see this here um, I don't know get this to right in there where will go this is I don't know probably about four, three and a half four inches across Something like that. Kind of hard in the hands with that edge, you know. But once I get a handle stuck on there, it's got a real nice feel to it. As far as the the balance and everything. Yeah, it's kind of getting hard in my hands. That sharp edge. I could swing it a lot harder if that wasn't cutting into my hand. Don't feel real well. Yeah, it's kind of <laughs> cutting in my hand a little bit there. I could be probably be through this thing already if it wasn't cutting in like that. It's hard in my hands, man. Yeah, every time I hit like that, it cuts, <laughs> cuts into my hand. There you go. Like I said, that'd have taken a lot less time if I'd have had a handle on there, or gloves. That works. Works really nice there. And you know, you can. Now this wood's wet, so it's, it doesn't cut real nice, but. Use it as a you know draw knife type thing, and uh, all kinds of stuff. You know, you could put a, if you wanted on the back here. You could use like a Dremel tool with a little cutting wheel, and uh, put a saw blade. You know, so far back here, and put a little saw blade in the back to cut with, um, if you wanted to. Um, but it's real nice, 90 degrees, they're real sharp, 90, makes some real nice sparks with your ferro rod. But, uh, yeah, so that's how you make a machete, or big knife, or 
whatever you want to call it, um, out of a, a chainsaw bar, an old chainsaw bar. Um, like I said, put a nice coat of deer coat on there and a nice handle on there. Make yourself either a leather sheath or a kydex sheath. But that sucker lasts you a long, long time. That's good steel right there. Good steel. So, I haven't tried showing any, or, or getting any sparks off of it, but I imagine you could. So, well guys, hope you enjoyed this. And uh, with that being said, take care, God bless, and we'll catch you on the next one. Have a good one.